wonderful time here. We celebrate Mother's Day, and we just thank God for all of our mothers and those yes. who men that have men, men that have actually children that you birthed, but you walked in the place of a mother. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. It's, it's wonderful when you find out that every one of your children, every one of the children that you meet are your child, your yes. children, and your generation. And we treat them like their own, own children. Now. Take care of them. Give them good advice. Thank God for our teachers who stepped in the place of mother and father. Amen. All the blessings. I thank God for our spiritual mothers. We thank God for the Jesus Faith Deliverance Church. We thank God for Pastor Lay. Amen. And, and who's already passed, Pastor Honey, who's already passed. Amen. But she was like a mother. Hallelujah. Yeah. We thank God for all those who are, who are godly yeah. mothers. Amen. We have Amen. a word for you. We have a word. Amen. We thank God for our supporters. We thank God for all the people. We go straight to the word of God because your time is important. And we recognize that. So we go straight to the word of God. Amen. We're going into the book of Acts, the second chapter, verse 37 to 39. And it reads, Now when they heard this, they were pricked in their hearts and said unto Peter and to the rest of the apostles, Men and brethren, what shall we do? Yes. Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ for the remissions of sins. And you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. For the promise is unto you and to your children and to all that are far off, even as many as the Lord God shall call. Hallelujah. We focus our attention here. Amen. It tells us that you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. And if we can use for a topic today, today it will be the gift of the Holy Ghost. Amen. The gift. We thank God for Amen. gifts, and this is a season where people are giving the mother's gifts. And what a wonderful mother's gift if you can receive heaven's best, the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes. I thank God for the power of the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is not a second-rate God, but just as much God as the, as the Father and the Son. We yes. thank God for the Holy Spirit. Amen. Yes. One thing about God, he's so big, hallelujah, that he has the whole world in his hand. And he's so intelligent that he can put his spirit in. Uh, uh, right inside your heart. Hallelujah. And we want his spirit in our heart. Oh, I remember the time when God touched me. Yes. I remember when God filled me. I remember yes. the change that happened in my life. And God can, what God has done for me, he can do the same thing for you. How many can testify that the, the yes. Holy Spirit is heaven's best? Yes. There's nothing greater than the presence of God. Uh -huh. There's yeah. nothing greater than the power of God yes. living on the inside of you. There's nothing greater than the Holy Spirit coming and giving you peace and wisdom and joy. Yeah. Nothing better than, 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 than God himself coming in and being your comforter. I thank God for the Holy Spirit. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. This Mother's Day, oh, I pray yes. that every mother is and mother there to be. Yes. Hallelujah. And everyone to be filled with the Holy Spirit. Yes. Thank God. Hallelujah. This is a season where people are troubled on every side. Yes. This is a season look like we're coming out of the pandemic, but we just don't know. Yes. Hallelujah. But God is a healer. Yes. God is a deliverer. Right. Amen. When you want the action of God, yes. when you want the power of God, it's going to come by the way yes. of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Amen. He says here, you should receive. And the gift is for you. Amen. If you don't receive anything else this Mother's Day, receive the power of the Holy Spirit. Even if you need another dip. Huh? Some people need another touch. Huh? Some people need to be stirred up. Yeah. Sometimes we're too stiff. Hallelujah. Sometimes you gotta, you, 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 you're just sitting there and God wants you to lean and God wants you to rock. And Sometimes God has spoken to you to get up and run, but you're too worried about what other people say. You're too worried about what other people want, but sometimes God wants you to move around and get excited and yeah. praise God and yeah. worship Him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't worry about what other people think of. Hallelujah. Because when you really get free, I'm telling you, when you really experience a real move of God, yes, hallelujah, and your soul is on fire, and your heart is on fire, somebody know, hallelujah, when the taste is gone out of your mouth. Yes. Somebody know when you're free and yes. free at last. Hallelujah. How you behave when you're free. It's time to run when you're free. It's right. time to shout, and it's time to tell somebody yes. about the goodness of the Lord. Yes, right. Oh, yeah. the boldness that comes 
from the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Hallelujah. Sometimes when you're lingering in a place where his presence is, you don't want to go nowhere. You just want to sit there Amen. in the glory of God. Yeah. It's time that the church receive the glory of God. Yeah. It's time that the believers be filled with the glory of God. Yeah. It's time for the church to experience his glory. Hallelujah. I've been in churches where the Holy Spirit comes in like a fog. Hallelujah. And the cloud been in the place. Somebody knows. Somebody watching Hallelujah. the video That's has right. been in the same service with me and can yes. testify Amen. what God has done. Yes. Hallelujah. He's still a healer. Amen. He still has power. Amen. Yes. His spirit is still sweet. Hallelujah. That's right. That's right. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Let's go to the book of Galatians, the fifth chapter, verses 22 to 25. It says, but the fruit of the spirit is love. We're not talking about any kind of love. Amen. We're not talking about, about anything but agape love. The God kind of love, yeah. the God, the unconditional love yeah. comes from the fruit of the spirit. Amen. You can raise, you can love. And if you have an adult child, that's what you read, yeah. an adult child that might be out there in the world, an adult child that might be bound with, with addictions or something, by the grace of God, you can still love. Yes, sir. And we pray for them. Amen. In the spirit, there's joy in the midst yeah. of all that's happening, in the midst of the election time. Oh, now they're bringing back up abortion. All kinds of stuff happening. This and there's another. It's like the dividing and dividing and dividing. But I got joy yeah. in the midst of what the politicians are doing. I've got joy yes. in my heart. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Because this joy that I have the world didn't yes. give to me. Yes. And then the world can't take it. Yeah. Hallelujah. Because the world didn't give it. That's right. Amen. Peace. Peace. I've got peace. He said peace. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Peace is shalom. Nothing missing, nothing broken. Yeah. I got long suffering. Yeah. I can make it through my college classes. Yeah. I got long suffering. Yeah. I can go to work for 12.25. I got long suffering. Yeah. I, even though I have somebody that's mistreating me, I ain't got to cuss them out. Yeah. I got long suffering. Yeah. I can see a change coming. Yeah. People can come into church and they still need their deliverance. But I got yeah. long suffering because I know God was, was patient with me. Yeah. I'm going to be patient with you until you're filled with the Holy Spirit. That's right. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Yeah. Gentleness. Amen. That's right. the, the Spirit of God is a gentle spirit. Yeah. Hallelujah. He comes in with a still, a small, still voice uh, yeah. piercing even your heart. Amen. The fruit of the Spirit is goodness. Hallelujah. When you do things, you do it good. Amen. When you cook, you cook good. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When you behave, you behave good. Yeah. Hallelujah. And also faith. Yeah. We've got to believe God, y'all. Because without faith, it's impossible to please God. That's right, that's you got right. to believe God. And where it all comes from, yeah. the, from the fruit of the Spirit. Yes. Meekness. How it mean, means that you're teachable. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Some people, you can't tell them nothing. Yeah. You don't have the know-it-all spirit. But you're quiet and teachable. Yeah. Temperance. Yeah. Amen. You ever had temperate guys yeah. that yeah. don't break every time? The devil's going to break at you and you break and fall apart. You have no temperance. Hallelujah. Or you can't control your temper. Thank yeah. you, Lord. Again, such there is no law. Hallelujah. And that's why you need the baptism of the Holy Spirit gives you all these blessings. Yes. Yes, right. Amen. It says, and they that are Christ have crucified the flesh with the affections of lust. Amen. It also says, if we live in the Spirit, let us also walk in the Spirit. We need to be, we need to have spiritual walkers. I thank God for a saved mother. Yeah. Thank God for a mother filled with the Holy Ghost. Thank God for a mother that's walking in the gifts. We need mothers that can prophesy, y'all. We need yeah. mothers that, hallelujah, they don't got to always run at the medicine. We can take some anointing oil and lay hands on your children, hallelujah. Rebuke yeah. the devil. We need mothers, hallelujah, that when they kiss their kids and send them on to school. Be like the prophets. If did my spirit go with you when you went? Uh, you can't come back to a, a, a mother with a lie uh, if she has the spirit of a prophet. Uh, yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. We need prophesying mothers uh, yeah. during this season. We need praying mothers to pray your children off of drugs. Yeah. We got everybody <laughs> talking about how we're going to get the guns off the street. But if we have a praying mother, <laughs> hallelujah, yeah. who know how to pull down strongholds. Because the weapons are warfare, they're not carnal, but they're mighty through God. Then they're pulling down the strongholds. Yeah. We can rebuke that game spirit. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. We can pray for our loved ones and they'll get off of addictions. Oh, hallelujah. We need a yeah. praying mother. Thank you. Thank you, Lord, for a praying mother. Hallelujah. And the Gospel of John, the 14th chapter. Amen. This is the Amplified Bible, verse 26. Amen. It says, but the helper, 
Hallelujah. The Holy Ghost is a helper. Receive this gift this Mother's Day, yes. and you're going to have some help. Yes. Hallelujah. You're going to need some help down the road. Yes. But there's no greater help than the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes. The helper, the comforter. Hallelujah. When that door closed, boom. And that child walks out, and you don't know what they're getting into or what they're doing. Amen. Now, today we had got cell phones, but back in the day, you had to go to a, put the money and go, 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 if you had to die. Yeah. Hallelujah. But mama, amen, instead of worrying, she would get on her knees and pray. Many times they'll come in the house way too late, walk by her room, and she was kneeling on her, by her bed praying. Hallelujah. We need mamas that can pray instead yeah. of worrying so yeah. much of what yeah. your kids yeah. are getting into. They need to pray. Receive yeah. the gift of the Holy Spirit. You can pray yeah. in the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. The advocate. Amen. If nobody, sometimes life will make you feel like you're alone and nobody's on your side. But the Holy Spirit will be on your side, will stand by you. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. And lead and guide you. He's an intercessor. Oh, yes. He, when you get blessed with the power of the Spirit of God, he's praying for you when you drive. Yeah. Amen. It was just the other day. My daughter and I was in the road, at least 10 seconds behind us. A dump truck flipped off in the woods. Yeah. 10 seconds now. Yeah. 10, I believe our intercessor was praying. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank and the you. testimony was she saw it in the mirror. Yes. yes. That's how close it was. Yes. Amen. Thank God. Hallelujah. And, and this danger seen and unseen that's come right by you, but it's the intercessor that's been making it. He's a counselor. Amen. You're confused and don't know how to do it. Amen. Pray for a while and set for a while. And the Spirit of God will come in. He's a strength. Yeah, yeah. Amen. He give you the spirit of might to push your way through obstacles. Yeah. Hallelujah. To, to, to go ahead and go to work even though you don't feel like it. Yeah. Amen. To prepare that meal and do a good yeah. job even though you're tired and you, but you still can go and cook. Yeah. How many know that it takes work now? To clean the house. Yes, because if you ain't clean, you can't teach your kids to be clean. Oh, but sometimes it's hard work to keep a house yeah. clean. The laundry. Yeah. Come on now. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. The Holy Spirit gives me strength. Yeah. Hallelujah to make it. Yes, He's a strengthener, a standby. Amen. The Holy Amen. Spirit, whom the Father will send in, Christ says, in my name, or he'll send it in his place to represent him. Hallelujah. And act on his behalf. He will teach you all things. Ooh, thank God. For the power of the Holy Spirit. I had a great uncle. Amen. Third grade education now. He was, he, and, and he took the test to go into the Navy and passed the test. Third grade education. Yeah. Hallelujah. He became a fixture. Amen. He was one of the best mechanics in our neighborhood. And he was a be, one of the best businessmen in our neighborhood. He would teach the community. He would teach other, other um, people his age who could not read. He was in World War II then now. He would teach reading to his family and, and friends and community. He would fix things. He would teach them how to open up a bank account. All type of things. How? Because the Holy Spirit will be a teacher. Yes. Yeah. Hallelujah. You. you may be confused today. You may not know how you're going to make it. You may have more uh, month than money. But the Holy Spirit will teach you. Yes. Will send people your way. You have a divine appointment. The Holy Spirit is greater than the internet. Amen. He can give you a divine appointment. Amen. You can work things out. Yes. My yes. prayer for you this yes. Mother's Day is that you receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. Receive yes. the baptism of the Holy Spirit. Even if you've already been filled, there's another level that you can go in God. Yes. Hallelujah. I pray that you level up. Hallelujah. Yes. Yes. All the mothers yes. receive the baptism, receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. Why? Because you don't have to take the devil as an offer. God is for you, not against you. You have a right to be free. And that's the gospel truth. Happy Mother's Day.